the Ukrainians need not just medical and humanitarian, humanitarian help. They also need emotional. They also need uh, psychological support because they feel like they're alone. As Ukrainian fighters stall the Russian invasion of their homeland, Canadians are stepping up to provide medical supplies to the besieged Ukrainian health system. From the first day we know the war is starting, we start to do something. We are collecting supplies and medication from hospitals, clinics, pharmacies across Ontario to be delivered to Ukraine. Ukrainians make up one of Canada's largest ethnic minorities, 1.4 million in all. Svetlana Yenchinska is one of them, a denturist with her own practice in Mississauga. She's using her knowledge to collect needed medical supplies based on a list provided by colleagues in Ukraine. We have some requests from the hospitals from Ukraine. We work to get directly to the Ukraine Ministry of Health. And uh, we have some list of medication depends on the, the hospital. For example, um, um, child sick hospital ha needs something there. The, some hospital needs insulin. The some hospital needs whatever the, the hospital needs. Speaking to Breakfast Television, Yenchinska says she's already received donations from local pharmacies, but she's now asking hospitals, pharmacies, and clinics to look at their own inventories and contact her organization to see if they can spare anything for the war effort. We have some list of medication. We send this on to the hospital in Canada, to the pharmaceutical company in Canada. They help us to collect this on. If we send directly to the location they need right now. Yanchinska says the war has been a terrible burden. With family in the old country, she's not just fearful for their lives, she's worried about their mental state. Being bombarded constantly by Russian forces, it's easy for Ukrainians to feel totally alone. Every morning I woke up and I just look at my phone and I see my sister alive, my mother okay. And this is very, very difficult. That's why the support we do not just association like, like we do, medical and humanitarian. We also help people to feel they are not alone. They are not lonely. We are here and especially thank you to Canada. God bless Canada. In Ottawa, Shali Lee, City News.